Okay, hi besties. I did my skincare, so my face is a little bit red because I did that ordinary BHA AHA mask. I don't know if you guys saw it in one of my last vlogs, but I do it all the time and I love it. Anyways, we're making Tyler his coffee because he's being sassy today. He's all like, are you gonna make coffee? I'm like, yes, I, I said, I'm gonna make coffee. Uh, anyone else's boyfriend, like a three-year-old obsessed with Starbucks? Because I started Tyler on the obsession. I got a job at Starbucks my senior year of college. And that was like my favorite. Um, like that started my love for coffee and being a barista. But he also became obsessed with coffee. So when I moved in together, I said, I need something to continue my love for coffee every day. And he's like, why don't you ask your mom? Because my mom was going to give me a housewarming gift. She's like, he's like, ask your mom for an espresso machine. And I was like... Okay, but my mom, like, I didn't want her to spend a lot of money because, obviously, I'm not that person. Like, obviously, I am a material girl, but I don't want my mom to spend the money. I want to spend the money. So, I gave her, like, a, a budget one that I thought was great. It is great. I love it. But I was like, you know, here's a budget one off of Amazon that's really good. So, I got the, the long, the, the long he, the long high. Stolista, I don't know. However you say it, the long he needs Stolista. I really like it. I think it's worth it. Um, and then we go to Starbucks every week and we get the beans. And this time I got them to ground it, but usually I ground it myself. Kind of excited. We get the espresso rose, which is just dark rose coffee. Fun fact. I found that out when I worked there. And so I get that dark roast and then I just make his coffee every morning. Tyler likes a vanilla iced latte with three shots. And we actually get, so this is where I'm gonna teach you guys a thing or two, because I worked at Starbucks. So if you buy the Starbucks beans, right? And then you also buy the Starbucks syrup. So this is the caramel. And this is the vanilla. Buy the Starbucks beans, get the Starbucks syrup, right? And then after you buy the syrup, they use 2% uh, from like, you know, just regular 2% from the store sometimes as their 2%. If you run out of milk, you usually go to the store and grab some. And they use Oatly as their oat milk. Their almond milk, I don't know a, uh, a brand that's similar to the almond milk. And the coconut milk, I cannot find anything similar to their coconut milk. Starbucks's coconut milk is phenomenal. I've literally considered going to Starbucks and buying a cup of coconut milk to make myself my own frappuccino. I don't know what's up, but their coconut milk is so good. So, just letting you know, if you want to make your own things at home, I would suggest it. I do love Starbucks, so I'm never going to tell you not to go there. Because if I was rich, I would literally be at Starbucks every day. Uh, but also, I, would, I feel like I would drink more than one cup of coffee a day like i would have my own in the morning and then in the night go to a starbucks just because i love it i don't know i just love starbucks as you can tell by my collection that i've shown you guys of starbucks things last night i actually used my shaker which is a reserve shaker because i had some drinks but yeah anyways i'm gonna start finish making his coffee and i just want to let you know his order mine is a Vanilla, here, I'll go grab. Mine is a vanilla hot latte with oat milk and um, two shots. That's my order. I saw these two girlies with the cutest purple car. Look at how cute it is. Look at how cute it is. Look, it's a little tiny barista area and it has a little espresso machine. This one is a little floor shop, and this one is a little tea shop. I love this store. Look, and they have Kirby stuff. Guys, look at how cute this is. There's socks, there's memo pads. This is so cute. Look, this machine has hella cute. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I gotta show you guys what I got. Guys, look at how cute. It's Texas Hello Kitty. And it's really small. I wish it wasn't this small. I saw they had big ones on TikTok. But 
I kind of got a small one because I could just throw my wallet in here. Let me walk you over to my closet. Don't look at my feet. Look at these socks. They're cute. They have berries on them. Okay. In my closet. Up here, I have this wallet. I also have a really cool wallet, but I'm thinking this can go in there with my phone. And then boom. And then I could put this really cool on the wallet. I don't know. I'm thinking for Christmas, I'm just going to switch it up. Or, let me see. Let me see. Does this match? No, that doesn't go together. Okay, I'll brainstorm and I'll let you guys know what I decide. Okay, look, I added it. He's so cute. And then this is what we got going on. And I just have my wallet and then I put my purse in here. Also, I think I'm going to keep this on here, this tag. But I might use something else to string it. I don't really like this. I might use a ribbon. I don't know. I'll decide. Look at how cute my outfit is. So I got this shirt. It has Karomi and my Melody. And then I have my Deuce Couture tracksuit. And then I have these, my Melody socks. I don't understand why it looks good blurry but that's fine and then i'm gonna wear some leggings and probably my black and white bands we'll see i don't know we'll decide hi guys good morning um today is my eight year anniversary lovely so excited um with my soulmate tyler we met when we were 14 and we're still together we moved down to texas together i don't think i've ever met someone better for me he's my best friend the love of my life one might say, you know, I would say. Um, I'm very excited. I'm gonna go out to Kroger to get him a few things. We already like got each other things, so there probably won't be any like big gift exchanges, but we already got each other stuff. And we're just taking it light this year. We actually wanna buy a house in the future. So we're gonna start saving up for that. Um, I woke up and my nose is super stuffy and I just feel my sinuses hurt. So I'm gonna see if I could get something for that. It's like my face hurts. I don't know. But we're going to go to Kroger quick. I got my little purse. I got my little, you know me. I've been carrying this Hello Kitty knife in public when I don't have my pew pew. I'll carry this <laughs> because, I don't know. It's just cute. I don't know. It's giving. But, yeah. So I'm going to go. I'm going to go grab some things. And then hopefully when I come back, I can go and take a shower and just get ready for the day. Anyways, thank you guys. Um, I hope you guys continue to watch and you get to see our anniversary together. Because we're going to try a new seafood boil place. We used to get seafood boil in Pennsylvania. So this is our first time trying it in Texas. And I'm so excited. Okay guys, haul. Besties. So I got Arizona iced tea <laughs> for me. Because I'm about to tear this out before work. Um, I got Tyler this cute card. It says... The force is strong. And on the inside, it says something about marriage. We're not married yet, okay? It's been eight years, but we're not married yet, so. Because we've been married, we were 14. So technically, it's like we're dating again because we're living together. It's weird. But, like, look at this. This is the force is strong. Happy wedding. No, I'm I'm cross it out. I mean, actually, I should leave it in right. LOL, marry me. <laughs> um, I got my body wash. This is my jam. This pure peace body wash. Love it. Love to see it. Um, then I got this. I used to have this back home. This is like a, um, heat protectant. I don't know. It's by Tresemme. I had this back home and I never really used it because I never used heat. But now I use heat on my hair. I also got a lip liner. Don't tell Tyler because he's been like, why do you need lip liner? Your lips are gorgeous. But men don't understand. Okay, listen, they don't understand. That lips are in. Lips are in. And then I got him this. He's going to be mad at me because he keeps saying like, I wanna buy it, but it's so expensive. And he brought it before and he let, he liked it a lot. I don't know if it was the right flavor, so I'm gonna make sure I got him the right one. But I just feel bad, cause it's like, boy, you deserve it. He's like, it's so much money, but he wants to gain weight and he wants to gain muscle. And he's already getting like muscular because we've been working out like all the time, but he wants to bulk up so he can gain more muscle. So I got him this and I'm gonna keep getting him this. But then I got this. I got these things so that I could use on my face for my acne because I have to rub stuff on my face all the time and I don't like touching my face you know you'll see me do it like I literally push my hair out the way 24 7 anyways there is my haul I literally only got him two things but we're going out this afternoon so hopefully he, he enjoys that and he loves it look at how cute my outfit is so I got this shirt 
It has Karomi and My Melody. And then I have my Juicy Couture tracksuit. And then I have these My Melody socks. I don't understand why it looks kind of blurry, but that's fine. And then I'm gonna wear some leggings and probably my black and white bands. We'll see. I don't know. We'll decide. Okay, this is what I got. It's a seafood boil. Um, I got lemon pepper, clams, and snow crab. I think I got two clusters. And then Tyler got really, really hot spicy seasoning. He got two clusters of snow crab, I think. And then he also got uh, headless shrimp. And he got sausage, and then I got potatoes on their side. I forgot I got potatoes. I haven't even dumped it yet. It looks so good. Okay, look at how cute these squishmallows are. Look at it, there's a gingerbread. For those of you who don't know, my gaming name is Gingy, so I love gingerbread men. Look at it, they're so cute. I don't know. I don't know why I'm shopping for Christmas. It's my anniversary, ma'am. Okay, I'm sorry, there's a garbage truck outside, but you may, um, this vlog may be like a cluster of just random things that I've done in the past few days. And honestly, it's because I've just been like home. Like I've just been staying home a lot. Um, I think my Hashimoto's is flaring up, which I have Hashimoto's for those of you don't, who don't know. So my eyebrows are like starting to lose the top here. That's why I have some health issues going on, like my acne and also like my weight. So I have Hashimoto's and usually when I have a flare up, I get super, super tired and super, I get super, super tired and super, super exhausted and I can sleep for hours and hours. And yesterday I napped for like four hours and the day before I napped for like three hours and my head just hurts. So usually I know if I'm like having a flare up or in pain, usually it's my Hashimoto's acting up. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. And please be patient with me as I am not feeling well. Okay? Bye, guys.